Big Bang Theory Season 6 episode review video. Before I get into that, though, pretty important. If you are caught up to the point where I am in rewatching or watching The Big Bang Theory, or you're just not entirely sure, then you definitely need to take the initiative and pay attention to the episode's title, which, of course, I'll mention as well as put in the description for you. If that happens to be the case and you're not caught up, it would be my recommendation that you don't watch this video any further to stay away from any sort of spoilers. This will be The Big Bang Theory Season 6, Episode 21. The title of this episode is called The Closure Alternative. And this will be my review, reaction, recap after just finishing watching the episode yesterday. Sheldon asks Penny if she's recording shows on their DVR again. Leonard says their DVR may have been hacked to cover for Penny. And then Penny kind of sort of tells Sheldon it was her in her own words. She doesn't actually say it, but yes. Leonard tells Sheldon to delete one of his shows, but he wants to watch it in preparation for season three. But Leonard has to break the news to Sheldon that that show has been canceled by sci-fi. And Sheldon is furious. And I don't remember exactly what show it was. I didn't catch it. It's nothing that ring a bell to me, so I didn't care. Raj has Howard install a security camera at his place so he can keep his eye on Cinnamon all day long. And then he sees a blog that Lucy made about him calling the person by a different name, but all the things that Raj is and Howard had to break the news to him that she's talking about you and she had mentioned that he's feminine. In another scene with Howard and Raj, Howard is letting his dog Cinnamon lick him in the lips consistently and Howard thinks that's just a little weird. Leonard wakes Penny up at 6.30 in the morning to tell her they should watch Buffy the Vampire Slayer together. Sheldon, or I should say Penny, has really no interest. Is like, why are you waking me up at 6.30 in the morning? And then shuts the door and most likely goes back to bed. And now Sheldon calls the Sci-Fi Channel saying that he's the president and they've made a mistake and they need to put this particular show back on. But the person on the other end knows it's him because he's called before and the person hangs up on Sheldon. Raj tells Howard he finally read Lucy's blog about, oh, you know what? Actually, he didn't read it before, so he didn't know that she called him, a fem fe called him feminine. But on this one, he did notice that she had called him feminine. Leonard and Penny watch an episode of Buffy the Blan Vampire Slayer, which I've never seen. I saw the Christie Swanson movie, but never the TV show, surprisingly. Penny says it was cute. And Leonard feels like she didn't like it. Amy's trying to help Sheldon with his closure issue. So they start to play tic-tac-toe. Sheldon's about to win. And Amy erases the dry erase board. And they do different things like this. Where like they have uh, Domino set up. And before Sheldon's either able to complete what he wants to put on there. On the floor. Amy says we're done. Penny and Bernadette watch an episode of Buffy the Vampire Slayer, and Penny asks, why does he like this so much? Lucy comes over to Raj's place, and uh, Raj acts more manly. And then he eventually talks to Lucy about her calling him feminine, as uh, he'd been acting weird and strange all night. Sheldon finishes all the things that Amy didn't let him finish, and Penny stops over to tell Sheldon she loves that he's in her life. This is the new Penny. And as as uh, Amy's leaving, Sheldon's like, yeah, thank you. It's been so great. And then Sheldon finishes all the tasks that Amy uh, didn't let him finish. That was pretty funny, including the tic-tac-toe. And then Sheldon calls Bruce Miller, who's the showrunner of that show, and asks him how he was planning to end the show. And after hearing what the plan was, Sheldon says, no wonder why it was canceled. That's a terrible idea. And that's what ends the episode. So this was a pretty funny episode. I like the, the fact that Amy would start tasks with Sheldon and not let him finish those tasks because it was just driving him nuts. Of course, he eventually finished, him on, finished them all on his own, but it was still funny. So I'm going to score this episode an 8.3 out of 10. 
the character of the episode is going to be Sheldon. And as many of you know, I rank Penny because that's the reason why I started watching The Big Bang Theory. I guess I shouldn't technically say that. It was already on. My roommate had it on his DVR and I saw Penny on the screen. So I'm like, who is that? And then I went to watch it on my own. So on this episode, I'm going to give Penny an 8.3 out of 10. She's always looking great. So that's those are my thoughts on the episode. If you're a fan of the Big Bang Theory and want to help me out with the YouTube algorithm, did I say that right? YouTube algorithm, make sure that you Hulk smash that like button. Share this video with anybody you know. Put this video on any one of your social media platforms. Don't forget to sound off in the comment section about what your thoughts are on this episode. What would you rate the episode and who, if you had to choose, would be your character of the episode? And one could argue that Amy should be the character of the episode, but I have to give it to Sheldon. Let me know what your favorite moment is. And if you want to rank Penny like I do and give her a score, please do so. And then last but certainly not least, don't forget to hit that sub button. Subscribe to the channel. You're watching the video anyway. Join the team. Show your damn support and be a part of something special. And J-Dev will return.